you're looking to get a good quality webcam on the cheap or maybe even for free well today i will be showing you guys how to turn either a phone or a camera into an impressive quality webcam for your live streams all right so let's get into the video now first let's go ahead and tackle phones now there are a ton of incredible apps that you can install on your phone but the app that i chose is an application called droid cam so let me show you how to install it all right, so what you're gonna wanna do is open up the Google Play Store and then search for Droid Cam. And then uh, now you can see here this Droid Cam webcam for PC. You're gonna wanna just hit install. While this is installing, you're gonna wanna install Droid Cam on your computer as well. So you're gonna wanna go to this one and then download this Droid Cam. And as you can see on my phone, it currently is installed now. And I'm just gonna hit open now. And it says, thank you for downloading Droid Cam. Not the application is finished installing on both devices. As you can see now that I'm setting it up with the IP and everything. And you can see the excitement on my face when I see it working. Oh, yes, see that? And the quality is actually pretty decent. But if you do it through the web, you're gonna get frame drops. But the interesting thing is that Droid Cam actually can turn your phone into a webcam through USB as well. But for today's demonstration, I just did it through Wi Fi. Now, the next thing I'm gonna cover are those big fat DSLRs. So to turn a camera into a webcam, you're going to have to install a program. And that program actually varies in which brand of camera that you actually have. And all Nikon, Canon, and Sony brands of cameras actually have their own webcam utility software that you can use. And these are the names of the softwares. And this is the compatibility list for any of the softwares, if anyone is wondering. So if you see your camera in this list, then you would theoretically be able to connect your camera to your computer with minimal problems. Yes, there actually are some disadvantages and problems with a DSLR setup. The most common one and the most annoying one is your DSLR always dying on you. When you have it connected to your computer, it doesn't actually charge from that port, which is annoying. Now, a nice solve for that is something called a dummy battery, which is just like a battery that plugs into any old camera, but instead of being locally powered, it's actually wall powered. And then your camera never has to die again. And you can find a dummy battery for pretty cheap on the internet, but getting one from an actual trusted source is the safest option for you. So conclusion, I honestly really like how companies make it so easy to use these things as webcams. Normally, average webcams like this don't cut it because the webcam is very small, you know? And having something giant like this will definitely visually improve your face cam a lot. And um, yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you loved it, please subscribe. And I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. Bye!